Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Nick Gray, and today we're back with another smartphone camera comparison with the Oppo Find X7 Ultra and its quad camera system, and comparing that with the Pixel 8 Pro, which I'm using to record right now. As I do in all of these smartphone camera comparisons, everything that you see in this video is recorded on these two devices. So just keep an eye on the bottom of the screen to see which device and which cameras from that device are being used for the photos and video that you see. And just so you know, we're on location in Brazil this week in Rio de Janeiro. As you can see right behind me in the view, is absolutely phenomenal. So let's get to some side-by-side -side photo and video comparisons between these two devices. video capture from both of these devices using the selfie camera. Now, the one thing that I do like about the Pixel, it looks like we have a little bit better dynamic range when capturing video here, uh, but it does usually get a little bit better once the video is processed. But as you can see, the skies are a little bit bluer and you have a little bit more detail in the highlights here though. We're gonna flip things around to that main camera and show you the difference between the two. I'm in a little bit of a darker area. I'm gonna step outside here, get a little bit more light to give you that more fair of a comparison between the selfie cameras and the main sensors on the back of both of these devices.
And here we're giving a look at low light video capture. Honestly, it's a little bit brighter than what you take it in most low light conditions because we have this massive lights on here behind us. But as you can see, the sun has set already, but if you want the best video capture possible, even on both of these devices, you're gonna have to flip things around to that main camera, which I'm gonna show you right now. As you can see, the video is definitely a lot better. You get better dynamic range, better low light exposure in these situations, and of course, better depth of field. As you can see, the objects behind me are a little bit out of focus as opposed to what you see with that selfie camera. But let me know what you think of the results in the comments below, because I think there's really not that much of a difference here in a lot of different situations, but in low light, the Alpo should be doing a lot better than what the Pixel 8 Pro is doing. Let me know. So we're starting off day two in Rio de Janeiro at the Celeron steps, which are these behind me right here. Each one of these steps is individually decorated with tiles from countries from around the world. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. So let's show you some of the details. <music> And that's going to do it for this camera comparison between the Oppo Find X7 Ultra and the Pixel 8 Pro. Let me know what you think of the results in the comments below and which device you would rather use on a day-to-day -day basis for your photos and videos. For more camera comparisons and other reviews, make sure you subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for those. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.